Alright, so right now we are here at the Twin Residences One Bedroom with Balcony Deliverable Unit. So, sisimulan na natin ang pag-tour sa ating actual showroom. So, ngayon, Miss Angelie, so na-discuss na natin yung mga vicinity area, near places the area. So, dito naman tayo dumako sa loob ng building. So, what are the building features of these twin residences? Now, let's proceed with the, alam niyo na, mga inaantay niyong lahat is our sample computation. located inside the SM South Mall, the Spinas City. And now, ipapakita namin sa inyo yung showroom. But before that, magkakaroon muna tayo ng discussions regarding with our new launch project here in Las Spinas City, which is the Twin Residences. Alright, before we proceed, magpapakalala muna kami. Ako po si Angelie Karanagan, ang inyong property specialist. And here is my contact details. Alright, and I am Johnny Rivera, your property associate. And here are my uh, contact details. So, hindi po kami pwedeng contactin if in case na interesado kayo sa twin residences. So, now, let's proceed with the discussion. So, Miss Anjali, uh, meron ba tayong mga additional development around the area? Alright, we have two build, build, build projects near the area. We have the Cavitex C5 South Link and the LRT1 extension. In LRT1 extension, we will have the first five stations to begin operations by the fourth quarter of 2021. So, we expect that to cut the travel time from Manila to Cavite to 25 minutes from over an hour. Also, it will expand the current LRT1 capacity from 300,000 to 800,000. In Cavite C5 South Link, um, completed na yung segment 3A1 sa Marville to C5. Also, the full completion will be on the second quarter of 2021 to 2022. And it reduced the travel time from 14 minutes to 10 minutes. And it connects the major business districts in Makati to Taguig area to Cavite, Paranaque, Las Piñas, and Pasay City. Alright. All right. Let's proceed naman with the places of interest near the area. Alright, we have the Robinson's Place Las Piñas, 0.3 kilometers, SM City Center Las Piñas, 1.9 kilometers, University of Perpetual Health System Delta for 2.1 kilometers long, and then yung Perpetual Health Medical Center, we have 2.3 kilometers, and BI Las Piñas Satellite Office, 2.7 kilometers, Las Piñas City Hall, 2.5 kilometers, SM South Mall Las Piñas, 1.4 kilometers, SNEX Alabang, 6 kilometers, C5 Extension, 3.4 kilometers, and the Manila Cavite Coastal Road, 4 kilometers. Okay, Miss Angeli, another question. What are the other uh, neighborhoods near the twin uh, residences? Alright, we have the Nia Terminal, 47 kilometers, Medical Business Park, 3.1 kilometers, Northgate Cyber Zone, 4.5 kilometers, Mall of Asia, 9 kilometers. Akasha Hotel, we have 4.5 kilometers. Bellevue Hotel, 4.6 kilometers. Crimson Hotel, 5.9 kilometers. And for malls, aside from those mentioned, we have SM Las Piñas, 1.9 kilometers. Ivia Lifestyle Center, 1.5 kilometers. Alabang Town Center, 3.9 kilometers. And yung Mulito Lifestyle Center, 3.5 kilometers. Miss Angelie, since na-dictate mo na yung mga uh, malls na medyo malalapit sa atin, so meron ba tayong mga near places na like uh, educational institutions, places of worship, or hospitals? Yes, we have. Um, St. Francis of Assisi College, Las Piñas is 1.5 kilometers long. And then yung South Bay International School, 2.2 kilometers. Centro Escolar, Las Piñas, 3 kilometers long. San Beda College, Alabang, 5 kilometers. For hospitals, we have Las Piñas Medical Center, 0.5 kilometers. And then yung Asian Hospital and Medical Center, 5.6 kilometers. Alright, so thank you for that information, Miss Angelie. 
One more thing, bakit nga ba magandang mag-invest kay Twin Residences? Uh, Twin Residences is a complete development. It has a sustainable lifestyle. It is pedestrian-friendly. Strategic location, commuter-friendly. So, paglabas nyo ng, um, ng Twin Residences, may sakaya na mapunta Manila or going to South. It, it is also high potential investment. It secures your future with um, maximized returns. Like what we discussed earlier, yung dalawang build-build-build projects na malapit sa Twin Residences. Also, it is a dynamic neighborhood. It supports your on-the-go lifestyle. As we mentioned, yung mga neighbors na malapit sa property. Alright! So this time, let's proceed now with the scale model of Twin Residences. So to discuss more, so ipapakita namin sa inyo yung aming video. Alright, so this is the twin residences. It has the two towers. Um, this side is the Admiral Street. And this one is the Mendoza Avenue. On this side, beside here is the Robinson's Place Las Piñas. So, twin residences is a 1.3 hectares development. It has the two towers. It has a 25 floors, 20 residential floors, 1 amenity, 3 podium, 1 parking floor, and 1 for commercial floor. It has a total of 1,203 units for Tower 1 and 1,203 units also for Tower 2. And it has a total of 670 parking slots. Right. So here is the tower one. Yung katabi niya is yung side ng Robinsons. Dito siya sa Mendoza Avenue. And then here is the tower two. Ang katabi naman niya yung Admiral. Tapos may BDO dito. BDO Talon Las Piñas. All right. So in the ground floor we have the tower lobby. There is a tower lobby for tower 1 and also in tower 2 and then there is a podium parking for second floor up to fifth floor and then on the sixth floor is the amenity it has also a function and gym all right and the seventh floor up to the 28th floor is the residential units
Alright, so right now we are here at the Twin Residences One Bedroom with Balcony Deliverable Unit. So in here we have a unit area of more or less 25.13 square meter or 270 square meter feet. So, ayan. Upon entrance, ayan. So, makikita ninyo yung ating hallway. So, at the left side, makikita nyo yung ating comfort room or yung toilet and bath. And on the right side naman is yung ating kitchen area. Then, pag nag-proceed kayo is nandyan yung ating area for the living room or pwede ni kayo maglagay ng ating bedroom if you want. Then, kapag diniretso nyo is the balcony na. Alright? So now, let's go at the actual showroom. Ayan. So, sisimulan na natin ang pag-tutour sa ating actual showroom. So, hello there mga kapatid. So, nandito na tayo ngayon sa actual showroom at ipapakita namin sa inyo rin yung actual na design or deliverable unit na i-turn over sa inyo once na nabumili kayo ng unit dito kay Queen Residences. So, upon entry, tulad nga ng pinakita namin sa inyo kanina, on my right side is nandito yung ating toilet and bath, and on my left side is yung ating um, kitchen area. Alright? So, unang muna sa inyo papakita is yung finish ng ating floors. So, yung floors natin is uh, homogeneous tiles, while our walls naman is painted finish. Ayan, high tiles at the shower area as well. Ayan, makikita nyo mataas yung ating tiles sa shower area. It has also the, the shower fixtures. Ayan, kompleto na siya ito ating shower head. May lagay na rin ng soap. Of course, the faucet. Ayan. We have here the lavatory and the faucet. Of course, the tissue holder is over here. Ayan, and our ayan, bowl. Ayan. Bowl, bowl. Ayan. Then, ayan. So, high ceiling din siya as well. And meron na rin tayong fire extinguisher if in case na, if in case of uh, emergency. Ayan. So, there you go. <laughs> so, now, let's proceed in our kitchen area. Alright. So, then, right here, we have here our cabinet. This is our grease trap. Ayan. Connected to our sink. So, this is our sink made of uh, aluminum. Then, over here naman is meron tayong countertops and of course, overhead cabinets. So, ayan, dito niyo pwede ilagay din yung mga utensils and other kitchenwares. There you go. So, nasa sa inyo na po kung gusto nyo uh, ipa-renovate siya or you can also use this as is. And as well, we have also sockets in here para if you want na maglagay ng mga appliances like yung coffee maker natin or um, what you call this? The oven, pwede kayong maglagay dyan. And but, dito nyo pwede ilagay yung ating uh, designated for the washing machine. Alright, so yung mga uh, sabon, panlaba, pwede nyo rin ilagay dyan. Yung mga detergent and etc. So now, let's proceed na dito sa ating uh, living area. Ayan. This one is pwede nyo i-move yung uh, socket niya. Depende sa kung ang pangailangan ninyo. And of course, magalan meron din tayong socket. And this is our uh, bowl for divider. Bedroom. Okay, this is our bowl for the bedroom. Ayan, so pwede mo magaling na dining area or living area at the same time. Depende sa inyo kung paano nyo yung ma-maximize yung area. And high ceiling pa rin po tayo. Ayan, if you will notice, ayan, hindi ko pa rin siya abot. Kahit yung sabihin natin 5, nasa 5 feet ako, no? Alright, then let's go at the one bedroom. So, this is our bedroom. Ayan. So, ayan. Ganito rin lapad niya. Ayan. So, ayan po, mga kaibigan. <laughs> then, here's our balcony naman po. Alright. So, the view is depends on the unit na kinuha ninyo. So, kung meron naman tayong view for amenities, para mas maganda at relaxation, ah, talagang makaka-relax yung ating view if you want. So, so, we have here our sliding door. Yung partition ng ating bedroom sa ating living room. 
So, tulad na sinabi ko kanina, pwede siyang gamitin as is because it's useful naman. But if you want to renovate or to design more, pwede mo siyang uh, i-renovate. Yan. Kung hindi kayo masyadong fan ng ganitong uh, itsura, pero kung ayaw nyo nang gumastos, much better, okay na to. Alright, so let's go. So there you are, natuloy na namin kayo sa deliverable unit ng ating Queen Residences. And now, let's proceed with another question and answer portion. So ngayon, Miss Angelie, so na-discuss na natin yung mga vicinity area, near places the area. So dito naman tayo dumako sa loob ng building. So what are the building features of these Queen Residences? Alright, it, it has had three passenger elevators and one service elevator per tower. It also has a three fire exit stairs per tower and it has an automatic fire sprinkler system centralized main room per tower centralized garbage collection and disposal system including mrf and standby emergency power for common areas also we have the maralco power supply my power supply cctv coverage at site podium floors and then amenity areas and residential floors and also, it has a 24-7 security. So, that being said, what are the amenities? Do we have outdoor amenities and indoor amenities for these twin residences, Ms. Anjali? Alright, for outdoor amenities, we have the mirror pools, activa turf, kid zone, jogging pad, trellis step, central gazebo, central turf, and poolside deck. So, alright, ayan. So, medyo marami tayong mga amenities na pwede i-enjoy dito kay Queen Residences. And now, let's proceed with the, alam niyo na, mga inaantay niyong lahat is our sample computation. But, uh, disclaimer guys, our sample computation varies for the date na uh, finil namin itong video na to. And yung mga sample computations is pwede rin mabago. Depende po sa araw na nag-inquire kayo sa amin. So now, ayan, ipa-flash ko sa ating uh, screen yung sample computation for twin residences with one bedroom uh, with unit area of 24.03 square meters. So we have the payment term of 15% in 68 months. Then the rest will be the bank financing. So the unit... Uh, so the unit selling price is four million at ninety four thousand, which comes to uh, four million eight hundred fifty one thousand and three hundred ninety pesos. So inclusive na siya with twelve percent VAT and six point five other charges. So ano ano nga ba yung mga other charges? So inclusive. Uh, inclusive dito yung mga annotation fees like registration fees, legal fees, documentary stamp, and, uh, and etc. So in short, wala na po tayong mga hidden charges na tinatawag. So in 15% down payment, uh, we have, so in 15% down payment, magkakaroon tayo ng 727,708.50 na, na total down payment less our reservation which comes for 25,000 only. Ayan, makakuha na kayo ng unit kay Queen Residences. So, ilas natin siya sa 15% down payment. We will be having 702,708.50. So, yun is i-divide natin into 68 months which comes to 10,334 la lang for 68 months yan. Then the rest, 85% remaining balance will be going to the financial uh, bank financing na. Alright? So, what are you waiting for? Kung makumuha na kayo ng unit habang mababa pa yung value ng property natin. Alright? So, kung nasa abroad po kayo, nag-offer po kami ng webinar. So, ano pa din lang gawin, Miss Anjali, para makontak nila tayo? Ayan. Kontakin nyo lang po kami. We have the Facebook page, I have the Angelica Caranyagan and my FB page, SMBC-ABC. Also, here is my contact details. Pwede tayo mag-set ng Zoom. Alright, so pwede tayo mag-set ng Zoom meeting and at the same time, pwede ka ba makontact sa Viber, WhatsApp? Or... Yes, yes, yes. Uh, I have Viber, WhatsApp, Line, and also Telegram. Alright, so ako rin, nandito rin yung aking, ayan, ipopost ko na lang yung aking uh, FB page, then yung aking contact details, so pwede nyo rin ako contactin through Viber, WhatsApp, Line, and Call of course. 
si Sanjuli, baka lang kasi yung mga clients natin is nasa abroad. So, paano sila mag, um, may make ng down payment if in case na gusto nila or paano sila magbabayad kung sila nasa abroad? Meron ba tayong mga uh, payment channels dyan? Yes, don't worry. Um, ngayon, pwede na mag-pay ng down payment, also ng reservation fee through online banking. So, contact nyo lang kami and then we will assist you for the reservation. Alright, so sana nag-enjoy kayo sa ating video. Please do like and share this video. And don't forget to com comment down below kung may mga additional uh, questions kayo. So don't hesitate to ask. We are willing to help. Once again, I am John Rivera, your property associate. And I am Angelica Rinagan, your property specialist. Thank you for watching and see you again on our next video. Bye-bye! <laughs> in Las Piñas City, which is the twin residences. <laughs> so, by the way, before we proceed, gusto sa... Ano na siya? Tapos na? Complete na? Nagawa na? Okay, okay, wait, wait. <laughs> so, wala naman nakalagay dito. So, now, let's proceed na dito sa ating uh, living area. Ayan. So, dito lang pala is, meron tayong, uh, I don't know if what this one, if what, <laughs> so, ayan po, mga kayo.